Hello everybody, this is Dr. Hassani Lawati. Today I'll briefly talk about the types of calcium drugs which are available in the clinical practice and what are the difference between them. Now, we have commonly three types of calcium available in the clinical settings. We have calcium carbonate, calcium citrate, and calcium gluconate. I'm not going to mention calcium gluconate in this talk as calcium gluconate is available in an IV form and we usually give it in the emergency and inpatient settings when patient suffers from severe hypercalcemia. I'm going to compare between calcium carbonate and calcium citrate. Now it's very important to understand the concept of elemental calcium. Calcium carbonate has around 40% of elemental calcium, which means that each 1000 milligram of calcium carbonate will contain around 400 milligram of elemental calcium. On the other hand, calcium citrate has only 20% of elemental calcium, which means that in each 1000 milligram of calcium citrate, 200 milligram of elemental calcium is available. Calcium citrate has a very good absorption and most of the people, they can tolerate taking it without any problems. You don't require to have acidic pH in order to be taken and patient can take it any time with a very minimal GI side effect and the risk of milk alkali syndrome is very rare. Calcium citrate is very expensive though. Comparing to the calcium carbonate, the absorption is quite fair and you need to have acidic pH and that's why it's always recommend to take calcium carbonate with meal to get proper absorption. Calcium carbonate has a lot of GI side effects and milk alkali syndrome may occur. If you have any comments, please write them below and thank you.